Welcome back to this Guild Wars Let's Play. You're Sambo, Seraphis heals a lot, and joining us as always, well, goodness me, not as always, it's the very pink and brown, very different looking at Regina Chaylor Serta. How are you this evening, my lady? I'm good. How are you today, Sambo? Oh, I'm not too bad. Look at you. Is this an artifact of the pink day in LA? Is that what this is all about? This is actually some dye that I happen to have left over out of the 30 that I purchased um, from Pink Day in LA. 30? What the heck? What hey, the look, hell, the woman? The opportunity doesn't come along all the time. There was like, you know, it's only once a year you get to buy pink dye from Rose. So, yeah, I thought, why not? While I was, you know, had the opportunity, I'd just stock up. And, you know, even though the yellow, it did match the leather, I just, it just... It just wasn't working for me. I'm uh, I'm a I'm a clash kind of girl. Well, yeah. Well, look. Actually, I saw you on. Uh, now, what night did I see? I saw you recently. It was on. I think it was Saturday night. Was it? Saturday. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we yes. actually we actually were in the same room. <laughs> I know. We actually met up in real Doesn't life. Doesn't happen often. For once. And guys and gals out there. And by the way, welcome to this episode uh, this week. Um, I couldn't believe it reggie had the most awesome hair and you'd think to yourself gosh if i described it to you you'd think oh that would clash speaking of clashing colors but it didn't it was <laughs> you your hair looked amazing it was like this really i don't know how to describe it i know it was red um but it was kind the of colors called cherry bomb Oh, cherry bomb. Okay, that makes total sense because mm. I, I was about to try and describe it as being <laughs> both both bright and yet deep coloured as well, which kind of doesn't work. It's so hard to explain. But that, it looked absolutely incredible. How long have you had your hair that colour? Thank you. Um, uh, probably about two or three weeks. I'm actually thinking of dyeing it again tomorrow, though. <laughs> All right. Of course, because, you know, two or three weeks is far too long to have your hair cherry-bombed. Oh, my Lord. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> actually, and by the way, before we go on any further, speaking of bombing, we've got ourselves another special guest here, by the way. You might notice, guys, at home watching that there's three of us this week. That's because we've got here Zera Nemesis, who, by the way, Reggie, if I look on my friends list, is also Okin Olak. And I think you know who Okin Olak is from YouTube, don't you? Well, I know him on my friends list as the Shadow Nemesis. Ah. So he has, he has a few different alter egos out there. Yep. Like some people do. Um, <laughs> Cough, Reggie. Before I go. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> no. Um, yeah, we also know him as Blaze Gunshark from Blaze. YouTube. Blaze Gun Shark from YouTube, so a big hello to you. And of course, this is a character that we haven't seen him on before. So very cool. If I click on him there, you can see it's a Dervish Warrior level 20. And of course, it's always nice to meet up with our fans and viewers whenever we're here in Ascalon. So a big wave. In fact, hang on, there we go. Big wave, hello to you, and thank you very much for coming and joining us in our intro. And if you guys would like to do the same, of course, all you have to do is either send us a message or add us to your friends list. And of course, if you see us online, say good day. We're nice and friendly, and we'd be more than happy to have you come and say hi at the beginning of one of our episodes. Um, so, Reggie, speaking of Saturday night, of course, um, apart mm -hmm. from your awesome mm -hmm. hair... Uh, and your excellent, by the way, oh, whoops, you know, I'm clicking on the ground again. Play, <laughs> play too going? much. Wow. Yeah, that's what it is. Um, uh. I, for one, really like this pink, by the way. Look at that, folks. When we hover over it, it's so bright because actually that pink. Yeah. And oh, look, her hands. Her hands have it as well. That's awesome. Um, yeah. That, I've got that, little pink gloves on, fingerless gloves. Yeah, that's awesome. Those, that color pink, that's only available via the pink day in LA, isn't it? I think. Is that right? Yes, yes. Okay, all right. That's right. So, in other words, when I ultimately go and dye myself pink, uh, because, of course, Monaco and you guys ganged up on me and made me promise that I'd go pink in my next tier, will it not be that pink specifically, will it? It won't be quite as pink as that. Um, I believe if you mix red and white, it doesn't come up the same pink. Ah. Okay. But... Um, uh, yeah, I, I think it also depends on the class and the actual armor, what shade of pink comes up anyway, so... Oh, oh really? Yeah. Okay, 
All right, I, so I think so. Well, I, I know of things that I've dyed pink and then someone else gives the same kind of pink on a different kind of armour and it's looked different. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, well, that's kind of cool that it does, though, because it means it's it's kind of don't know what you're going to get or at least there's some kind of variation, which I like. Um, so God knows what it'll look like on me, by the way, when I go pink. Oh, I'm dreading the day, folks. And by the way, Reggie, speaking of our viewers, just had another little message come in here saying hi to us uh, and offering any help if we need it. Now, knowing you, you've probably already got them in your friends list because... We all know Reggie is such a social butterfly here in Ascalon. Everyone loves and knows oh, Reggie. Of course. Of course. So we've got a hello from Christina Thresh. And that's their Guild Wars character name. So I'm not sure what their YouTube username is. But there you go. A big shout out to Christina Thresh. Um, and thank you for saying hello. Now, Reggie, do you have them in your friends list? And if not, you probably want to add them. You do? No, I do. I do have them, yep. Oh, there you go. I knew and you'd they've have actually just asked me if, I, if I've got some pink dye for Sambo. Oh, oh <laughs> Christina! Is, I, ha I have some spare ones to dye, to dye his next level of armour. That was my response, so... <laughs> Great. So well, I'm I actually going to have... That I've, got, that I've got 30 odd. So I'm mm. actually going to have some actual pink. So some of that real pink has got my name on it. Is that what you're saying? Indeed. Oh, God. God, I thought I was going to get away with that. I thought, oh, at least I'll be able to have the not-so-pink pink. But no, Reggie's been nice and earmarked some of that there that you can see right there for me. Oh, Lord. Or oh, any shred of manhood that I had is just going to go right out the window. You realise that? <laughs> I'll hush you. Now, listen. Now, speaking of things, manly. On... <laughs> Calm down, woman. Calm down. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Listen to that, folks. See what I have to put up with. Do you know what else I had to put up with on Saturday night? Get this right. You had to put up with my awesomeness. That's all well, you need to tell people. Do you know what? Unfortunately, I'd like to be able to say different. But, you know, I'm going to have to agree with you because, folks, I am the WoW trading card game master, okay? I'm, out of all my uh. friends, I've, I've been playing it the longest, and, of course, I introduced Reggie to it. Now, Reggie, got to be fair longest and say... Longest does not mean the best. Well, no, in this case it doesn't because, of course, Reggie went out and bought herself her own deck, um, and, of course, she bought the character that was the most purple. I think that's what you asked the guy behind the counter, right? You, like... Didn't he say, what class do you want or something, I think? Yeah, he said, what class do I want? And I said, I want that box because it's purple. Right. <laughs> well, there you go. It's our Reggie. You know her in purple. Anyhow, that, of course, ended up being a warlock in the world of Warcraft. So that was very cool. But um, fair to say, Reggie, that technically speaking, compared to how long I've been playing the WoW TCG, you are technically a noob, right? Like, I mean, you've only had a couple of games. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, no, I'm completely... Yep, yeah, so so therefore, it. explain, then, how come in a tournament evening over about five games, and what do we got, one, two, three, what, six people, five people, something like that, after all of that, guess who comes out the winner of the entire tournament? Oh, my Lord. Yes, that's right, folks. It's her pinkness and purpleness herself, Regina J. Lacerta. I just, I don't know what to say. <laughs> How did you do that? You completely cleaned us all up. You won, you won the semis, you won the whatever the next one was, and then you won the ultimate final, and you cleaned up. Have, have you actually been playing for longer and not telling us or something? No, 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 no. I'm just that awesome. <laughs> and she's that humble as well. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? It's absolutely deserved because you absolutely kicked ass chewing bubblegum and uh, you absolutely cleaned us all up. I can't believe it. But you know what? The most, um, the best part of it all was it was heaps of fun. It was so awesome. I love playing that game oh, with was. you guys. Yeah, so if you're yeah, at home... If you're at home thinking, what on earth is the WoW trading card game, just go look it up online. You'll be able to find lots of videos of it and stuff. And it's a collectible trading card game. Lots and lots of fun when you've got good friends and uh, alcohol. And let's face it, wherever there's a Reggie, there's alcohol. So we had it all going on <laughs> on Saturday night. So um, thanks for that, though. It was lots and lots of fun. I, Anyhow. I would, I would say, I, mean, I wasn't drinking, but I was. I was nicking your drinks. 
Uh, <laughs> well, that's true. Actually, they were they were really good. It was um, we were drinking pear and also apple cider. I think it was, wasn't it? Cider mm. was really, really very yep. nice. Um, so that was obviously uh, she. That was Reggie going for her drunk title in real life as well. Although, like I said, it didn't affect her ability to play cards, and she absolutely kicked it. Absolutely, wiped the floor with, his lo- with well, the lot. Well, can lotters. I just say, speaking of my drunk title, yes. If I just do this. Oh, oh. There we go. Oh, that was absent. <laughs> I've just. Yep, that was absent. Now, looking at my titles, I have drunkard and and i'm not really sure how to how to put the title on so you can see it oopsie i'm too oh, there it is. trick no i can see it screen. i can see it i can see it i'm hovering over yeah. you and so hang on with that very drink just then that got you the drunkard title yes. is it you're that kidding got me the drunkard title oh well done well done <laughs> let's give her a round of applause well done regina the drunkard so there we go, art imitating life. <laughs> Congratulations, <laughs> Reggie. Oh, that oh is... well, I'll just have to do this then. <laughs> she just, again, just like real. Oh my God, look at her. She's, she's going nuts. <laughs> your, no, I would hate to see your screen right about now. That'll be absolutely bonkers. I bet you can't see a damn it's thing. It's very pretty. Yeah, very blurry in other words. How about that, folks? Mm. I hope you congratulate it in the comments because that is a very difficult title to get, The Drunkard There, and well done. How long have you been going on that one? That's been ages. Oh, that has been a while of doing the daily grinds and getting the Dwarven Ales from Nicholas and, you know, festival drinks and everything that I could, yeah. Yeah, so congratulations. That's fantastic. I, I, well, hang on. Where do we look at the, um, is it in the H, isn't it? Here we go, H, titles mm-hmm. and... Okay, I've got Drunkard, and I've got six points out of 1,000. Uh, yeah. So I think, I think I've got a little way to go <laughs> somehow. Actually, yeah, uh, what else have I got here? Do you know what? The biggest one I've actually got is Wisdom Title Track, and that is 14 identified uh, rare items, and that's out of 100. <laughs> I know, that, that's the biggest oh, I've wow. got. I know, pretty sad compared to your efforts, I know. But there you go. Well done, Reggie. I know you've been wanting that for ages, and it's awesome that you actually achieved that uh, in our episode. So once again, folks, make sure you pass on your congrats to our favourite pink and brown Reggie here. That is awesome. Now, speaking of things that we have to do, we should get going because we got <laughs> some quests. You might remember last episode, Reggie, we were uh, royally saved over... Well, over the course of three episodes by our good mate, Ultra and Alt, as we did the Frost... No, not the Frostgate mission, the Ballas Pass mission. And, of course, that was lots of fun, but all it did was open up the Frostgate mission here, so no doubt we'll have to get someone back to help us do that one. But for this episode, um, Reggie, we're here in Yaks Bend because I think you've got a couple of quests in your log, just like me here, Minar's Worry and, most importantly, the Shiver Peak Stragglers. Is that what we're doing next? Um, yes, Shiver Peak Stragglers. All right, okay. So looking at this, it says we have to search the road to Ascalon for refugees. And it says our trek into the mountains is proving a dangerous affair. And we've hardly begun. A few families who set out with us from Ascalon did not make it here to Yaks Bend. But I have hope that they may yet survive. So I need someone to search along the road back to Ascalon and help out anyone who might be stranded. Are we up to the task, Reggie? I think we are. What do you reckon? Well, we can always try. Well, yeah, we, that's what we do. Well, look, I think it's up to you to lead the way, and it's probably time now to say um, ta-ta to our good friend here. Uh, where's he gone? Zyra. Zyra I don't Nemesis. know. Oh, there he is over there. He's gone to his chest. So we'll pop over and say hello. Well, we won't say hello. We'll say goodbye. Give him a wave. Nice of you to stop by, Blaze Gun Shark. Thank you for that. And, of course, um, maybe you'll be able to come along and help us out in one of our missions in the future. That would be really nice. So thank you very much for your support of our channel. All right, so would you... I think why don't we swap him out with one of our henchies and then we can head yeah. out now. One thing I do notice, by the way, Reggie, is that mm. you have... Um, mm, now, I don't know if to take this as an insult or what. Good Lord, you've got... Have you got a healer? Have we got a healer? No, hang on. Yes, we have. We've got a monk. Yes, I have put a healer in the party. 
Now, it's 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 nothing against you. <laughs> Sorry. Right. <laughs> However, it was actually suggested by one of our viewers that having a healer um, um, sort of uh, 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 coming along to basically do the healing, yeah. and then if you sort of did more of the smiting, so instead of oh. sta standing back and just healing, if you actually did a bit more attacking, you know, right. it My could be... Could be beneficial. Beneficial. Okay, mm. actually, you know what? Come to think of it, I do remember that comment, and I thought it was a good idea. So, why not? Now's as good a time as ever. So, here you go, folks. I know you've been waiting for this for a long time, and poor old Zyra there is trying to trade with us. Zyra, if you're watching this, or oh, Blaze Gun Shark, if you're watching this episode, um, we will trade with you later on, I promise. But we're running out of time here. Now, so what I need to do, and this is a good thing to demonstrate, by the way, isn't it, Reggie, about how you can completely transform your character from, in this case, a healer to a damage dealer. So you've gone and put a, mm. what have we got there? We've got a monk, we've got Elysia there, monk in the party as one of our henchies. So I'm going to basically get rid of, firstly, folks, get rid of all my attribute points. And I'd say that's a good place to start, Reggie, to sort of zero them all out, because, of course, we won't want anything in healing prayers, will we? Mm, yes. All right. Yes. So no, here we go. You don't want healing? No. No. Now, again, folks, if you're a WoW player, this will be very, very strange to you because we don't have to go and pay a big in-game fee to respec. Okay. All I'm doing is, you can see there, I'm just using the minus arrow down there, and it's automatically reset all of my 75 points. This is how easy it is to change spec. And you can see down the bottom here, all of my skills have grayed out, and I'm just going to drag them off the bar like that. This is so bizarre, Reggie. Okay, if you could see my screen now, I have zero, absolutely zero points, no attributes, and zero skills. I am but a husk of a man. Well, husk of a, a woman in this case. So, um, <laughs> this is how simple it is though, folks. So I'm going to, Reggie, I'm going to put all of my smiting spells onto my hotbar here. And I notice I've got a few enchantments. We've got a... Bane Signet, we've got a spell called Banish, we've got Smite, the Bane Signet there, Symbol of Wrath, that's the one where we get all of the mobs that are adjacent to us, of course, and I've also got Strength of Honor, which is an enchantment there, and that means that while I maintain this enchantment, my target ally deals five more da damage in melee, so oh, it's not really going to help you, is it? Because you're not really melee, are you? You're ranged, so maybe, maybe that's not a good one to use. Um, yeah, we'll get rid of that one. That's no use. Retribution. This is an enchantment here. While you maintain this enchantment, whenever the target ally takes attack damage, this spell deals 33% of the damage back to me. Um, so that's interesting. Oh, no, back to the source. Oh, so it reflects. All right, that's good. Okay, now, Reggie, I've got three spare slots. Would you like me to put a resurrect on here anyway? Because it doesn't require any particular skill attributes. So that could be handy. What do you reckon? Uh, is it a resurrection signet or is it a resurrect spell? That's a great uh, question and I've got both. What do you reckon I should put on? Put the resurrect spell instead of the signet. Okay. So that means it's more than one use and it doesn't, yep. Yep, doesn't require any attributes either. Okay, I've got two slots left. What do you think about purge conditions? Uh, that doesn't require any specific attributes either, and it removes poison disease. I do remember that being, yeah, that was quite handy okay. when you did use it previously. All right, no problem. And we've got one slot left, and yeah, I don't know what to put on here, because there's no point. Oh, I could put protection prayers on. What's this one? No, shielding hands. They're all in. I don't really like the enchantments, to be honest, too much. Um, maybe what we'll do is what's in divine favor divine boom what's that oh that's an enchantment as well maybe what i'll do reggie is just put a heal maybe the heal party on here anyway um yeah and there we go heal party oh hang on i've just lost one sorry sorry there we go all right so yeah i've put the heal party on there as well now in order for that to work <clears throat> I still don't need to actually put any points into healing prayers, do I? Oh, hang on. No, do I or do well, I not? Well, you've got the heal party. Yeah. Or do I? Well, you don't actually have to. So it will still but, work. Um, it just, yeah, it will still work. It'll just work at a lower level. 
Oh, okay, that's right, because it's just a little bit of an emergency spell there, So, because I'd rather put yeah. all of my points into my smiting. So I'm just going to make sure... What do we got? Smiting. I'm just checking all my attributes now of my skills. Smiting, 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 and smiting. Right, I'm literally just going to go nuts on smiting prayers, and there we go. It's up to 10, and that has increased Wow. The, yeah, that's good. So let's put the ability up to all of them. I might as well put the remaining few into healing prayers. There we go, max that out, and then the rest into Divine Favor. Because, of course, putting points into Divine Favor, I think that just increases things on uh, across the board anyway. All right, there we go. I am now, how's that? I am now a Smiting Monk. There you go. So this will be very interesting. Well, let's see Let's see if you're any more useful now. Oh, 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 oh nasty. <laughs> All right. <laughs> let's let's get out of here. Lead the way, the Shiver Peak stragglers. Whereabouts is it that we have to go? By the way, oh, over there. There we go. Well, it is out this exit. I, I've I've gotten the correct exit this time. Not this taking the scenic route. Yeah. Not that there's anything wrong with the scenic route, of course. Okay, no, I can see an asterisk. Not. It's basically at the end of this road, isn't it? All right, this is going to be really weird for me because here I am now. I'm an attacking monk not a healing monk. Now let's hope that Elysia does her job. All right, here we go. Now presumably, Reggie, what this will mean is that we'll chew through the mobs a lot faster, I'm guessing. I hope so, I hope so. You know, it means that if you're actually useful, we might get through it faster. Oh, oh she's so nasty. Um, but she's absolutely nasty right, by the way. Nasty or honest. <laughs> honest, she says. Now, <laughs> is our is our party actually healed up just because we automatically recovered, or did our healer actually do stuff then? I I'm believe she sure. may have done a little bit there, yeah. Yeah. Now, where is she? I can't... Is it she or he? Where are we? Oh, there she is. Okay, so she's actually wearing the monk garb. Uh-oh, whoops, I targeted someone behind us. Typical me. Oh, of course. Oh, God. Mind you, I'm really chewing through them. Gosh, it makes a difference, doesn't it? I'm noticing the actual difference in DPS. Because, gee, these guys would have taken absolutely ages to kill before. It looks like you got one on your own. Yeah, I know. Amazing. Wonders will never cease. Wow. <laughs> Hush you. Let's go grab those And he coins. dropped something for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. I think that healer is doing a good job, actually, to be honest. This could be this could be fun. This means we could actually make progress a lot faster than we're normally used to. Shock horror. Imagine that. I know. Mind you, of course, if it's advice that's come from one of our viewers, uh, it's probably better than anything we'll dream up, I'd imagine. Wow. Oh, we, yeah. Uh, Coming from our viewers is probably well-founded. Yeah. <laughs> we are chewing through these guys, though. That's, that's pretty good, I must say. Yeah, well, we're back at that spot where we died horribly multiple times, so... Oh, so good test. Let's see if you can, you know, do some good. <laughs> She's so nasty to me, folks, isn't she? I'm not saying it's not true, but she's nasty all the same. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you need to win my confidence. Yeah. Right, let's zoom Doesn't out. Doesn't automatically. Bit of a look around. Oh, is someone behind us? Yeah, we're actually not doing too bad. I mean, we're all down on health a little bit, but we're no one's died yet. Yeah. And you know, if you were doing the healing, oh, we would have died you. half a dozen times, Ben. <laughs> hush, hush. I can't disagree. Oh, oh, our healer is down. Our healer's down. Yikes! Oh, oh, and I'm nearly dead. the healer first. Oh my lord, I'm going to use the heal party. Oh my god. Okay, my heal party is really crappy because I've got no points in it. And it wasn't enough. Oh well. There's still a few of us fighting, but it's... it's yeah, we're yeah it's a bit of a battle now. Yeah. Can Reggie and Hello Kitty keep this up? I somehow doubt it. <laughs> it's against all no, odds. No, there I go. Oh dear. All right, now. Oh, and now they're just pummeling on Hello Kitty. Yep. Oh dear. Okay. 
So, now listen you healer, you can do better than that. Um, what do you think, are we close enough to go to Yaks Bend to get rid of our sickness or will that just reset everything, won't it? Oh! Oh! Wait a minute, I know what you're doing Missy. Look at that, we've got the four leaf clovers on the ground and we've got that. Oh, we're now plus five, we're now plus five, plus ten percent. I've got a funny feeling that Miss Regina J. Lacerta is weaving her <laughs> black magic over things. Is that the honeycombs, Reggie? That is the honeycombs again. Wow. How many of because them do I've you been, have? Since, well, since the last time I used them, I have been collecting my traveler's gifts still, and I now have 153. Oh my god, that is incredible. And not only is that incredible in terms of the number you've collected, but it's incredible because it means we actually don't have to worry about res sickness, which is huge. That's a huge big uh, worry off our mind, of course, because, you know, us, if we die more than two or three yeah, times... Yeah, but it doesn't mean you're not you're allowed to let, you know, just give up and die oh, whenever no. you feel like it. No, 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 not <laughs> at all. But uh, it's comforting knowing that it's there as a backup, that's for sure. Yes, it makes a good backup. So thank you very much. I can't believe how many you've got. That is so many. Seriously. Just through perseverance and daily, the daily grind. Yep. Grim determination and lots and lots of hard work, basically. I oh, never. Mercs could do anything. They're just standing back. Yeah, what is going on? I don't know. Now, by the way, I they didn't... Just they probably actually wanted to see if you were any good at smiting prayers yet. <laughs> Quite possibly, actually. Oh! Oh, there's bosses down here. Yikes! There's a big boss on the bridge. Now, I didn't actually have my, uh, my retribution up. And I'm going to make sure this is up while we maintain this enchantment whenever the target ally takes damage. So we make that you. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Um, basically, you deal 33% of the damage back to the source. So that's pretty. Oh, and our monk's dead again. Oh, and I'm dead. Not the monk. You're dead. Yeah, when I said the monk, I meant me. I thought it was our, our uh, henchman. Oh, dear. Okay, I'm going to heal the party. Here we go. It gave our healer a bit more of a boost. Oh, I'm going to oh, resurrect good. our healer oh, now. You go. Yep, resurrecting the healer. Oh, good, good. Oh, good lord. Heal the party again. See if I can resurrect our mage. Not enough energy. Ah! No, I think, I think, oh, I think we might all be in a bit of trouble. Yeah, this doesn't look so good. Oh, Well, we managed my. to get a few people down. <laughs> wow. Before we all got knocked down. This is nasty. You can see on the map there that we're only halfway to our objective as well. Good Lord. And have we... Hang on. It says we have to search the road for refugees. Are we meant to actually find refugees at the same time? Because I haven't actually seen any yet. No, I haven't seen anyone either. Okay. Oh, thank goodness for those honeycombs, I'll tell you that much. Okay, let's maintain this enchantment on myself. I think I still need it. There we go. <laughs> Whew. Now, maintain the enchantment, does that cut down on your... Um yeah. How fast your energy renews? It looks like it's uh, minus one energy renewal. But that's okay because I had uh, four pips up anyway. Just because of the skills I've got. Um, I've got a very high regen rate anyway. So it's not too bad. Okay. Well, we'll give it a try. Oh, there's still right. heaps, of, heaps of mobs here, but we'll... We'll give it a go. Yep. We've gotten through it before, we'll get through it again. Yeah. I'm going to use heal party. There we go. Because they're still taking big chunks out of us, you know. And purging the conditions. And I'm going to purge... Oh, 
Gonna heal party again. No, I can't. Hang on, there we go. Heal party. Boy, you know what? I still need to top it up with mine. Yeah, well, I suppose um, if there was like four healer henchmen, I'd probably put my faith in all four of them. Yeah, right. Over you. Thank you very much. Oh, our healer's <laughs> gonna... Look, our healer's died again. Gonna try and res her. Aww. Now, this boss... This boss is on us as well in the background here. He's shooting at us. Yikes. Well, we definitely are getting the numbers of the mobs down, though. Yeah, just. Oh, and the healer's dead again. The heck? Okay, we have to get this boss behind us because he's just tearing strips off okay. us. Okay. We should have targeted him, then I would have followed your lead. Oh, I was following your target. No. Well, he's gone now. Yeah, there we go. All right, I'm going to try and res the mage henchman. Here we go, resurrect. And I'm going to run around and pick up all these goodies. Yeah, that'd be right. There we go. And heal shopping, the party. Shopping, shopping, Reggie and her shopping. All right, we're fully healed up again. Now, we've actually run out of time for the episode, but let's see, how close are we? We're getting there. Should we carry on just a little bit more? See how we go? Let's see, have a push and see if we can at least Get spot through. one of the refugees. Yeah. Haven't seen a single one yet. But boy, this area, this has been a nasty area for us in this entire series, hasn't it? Doesn't matter what quest we're on, it's just it been horrible. It has, yeah. Mind you, it has taken us less time to get through it this time, and I think that's because maybe we don't have as many quests on the go. As, yeah. yeah. As one of our viewers pointed out. I agree. Less quests, less mob spawns. Yep. Which makes perfect sense when you think about it. I know. But of course, we just we just don't think. No. <laughs> oh, purple drop. Oh, congratulations. Okay. Now, I think it's just up here. Yeah, somewhere up here. See apparently. if I can tip tiptoe past the baddies. Oh, might need tip to pick this one off. <laughs> they go tip two through the baddies. <laughs> Gonna sneak up and see what the ah yes found it's something? up here. I have found something. But we'll get this guy off your back. Yeah, thank you. Who else is attacking? Oh, more shopping. One of those ice golems up the very top there. That one there that I've just marked. My oh, lord. A, Talk about a long and range. A boss here. Yeah. Dark green. Oh. If he's a ranger. Oh, well, that would be why he's using a bow and arrow, actually. Oh, uh, yeah, good point. <laughs> Get rid of this ice golem. And then hopefully we can go and talk to this guy. Okay. Whew. That was some hard work. Oh. Far out. Mm. Ah, there we go. All right. You know what I yep. think we'll do is we'll leave this on a cliffhanger. We'll come and talk to him at the beginning of the next episode because, of course, just like a good soap opera, there's nothing like a good old cliffhanger. Look at that. We're pink. We're blue. What a, we're like a blimmin' paint chart. That's what we are. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> We've got colour everywhere. All right. We finally made it. Now, we're looking right at Elysia here. Elysia, I know I'm not the best healer in the world, but... I don't know if you're much better, to be honest, but we'll keep pushing through and we'll see how we go. We're definitely cutting a swathe through the mobs a lot faster, aren't we, Reggie? Like you said, that that was definitely better than um, me not being DPS, I think, anyway. Yep, she's nodding in agreement there. All right, folks, so there you go. Lots to come in the next episode. The unfolding chapter of this most hideous area of the game for us. I think my name should be Sir Dies a Lot from this point on, especially whenever we're in this area. Stop cheering and clapping, you. <laughs> yeah. So I certainly hope you'll join us in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed this one on behalf of myself. And, of course, Seraphis Heals a Lot, our aptly named healer. Well, not anymore. Maybe I need to be Seraphis 
hits a lot. Maybe I can change my name. Who knows? <laughs> yeah, it's us saying take care. Certainly hope you're having a great day wherever in the world you are. We look forward to seeing you next time. We'll see you then, and bye-bye. Bye.